Step in and help. That's right. Camby Brown joins us live from Rio Linda with more. Hey, Camby. Good morning. I make no secret about it. They're two of my favorites, Pat and Tom. And this is why, because not only are they great DJs playing amazing country music, but also because they get involved in the community. So, guys, you heard that this happened, $12,000 worth of fireworks. And what would you do? Uh, we just kind of put it out there on Facebook and on the air, um, you know, talking about it, and we, we offered to come out and, and, and kind of help sell fireworks today, and this is the result. A lot of people are out here, and it's awesome. A lot of people came out. Not only are you doing that, but you're also giving people the chance to win tickets to see who. Kenny Chesney. So what do they need to do if they want to uh, register for that? Just put their name in the hopper, which I think you've done about 20 times. Yeah. So <laughs> that's all you got to do. I need to stop doing it because CBS employees are not eligible. They're going to see all my names pop up and be like, oh, back in there, back in there. Shauna, this is your guys' fireworks stand, Rio City Little League. You guys go here to open up the stand, and what happens? We found the container that was broken into, and they had taken half of our inventory. And people keep saying, oh, maybe they had a bad padlock. No, they bought the most expensive kind, the ones that are supposed to be, that people cannot get through. Well, guess what? Where there is a will, there's a way for criminals. They found a way. They stole so much of your guys' fireworks, $12,000 worth. If we don't have people coming out to your fireworks stand and buying these fireworks today through the 4th of July, what happens to the Little League? Little League just, um, you know, that, that money isn't recouped. We don't have, we need the fundraisers to continue with our spring seasons, our fall ball seasons, our tournaments that we're currently active in right now with All-Stars. And, um, you know, and for the kids, for the kids to get their uniforms and their equipment. So important. We have a lot of people that are here. This is on the corner of M Street and Rio Linda. There's another fireworks stand that's there on the other corner. This is the one in front of the liquor store. Okay, you guys are buying fireworks. For parents that are watching there right now, why would you tell them that they should come out and get their kids some fireworks? Because they're fun. They're fun? And, and what's your favorite one to see? What one, what do you like seeing? Um, this one. That one. Or, Supernova. Or, oh yeah, this one's very popular. Why does everybody like this? Of course, Pat and Tom like the one that does the number two. It's called Sir Dumps a Lot. It is a hit. It is a hit. And you guys still have a lot of them? Tom, do they have some, Pat? They're still back there? There we go. Okay. So they still have a lot of them out here. Come on out here. Support the Little League. Buy some fireworks. Again, it's on the corner of M Street and Rio Linda Boulevard. Pat and Tom going to be out here until about 11. You can register to go to Kenny Chesney. How many tickets do they get to Kenny Chesney? Two. We bought this for you. That's for you. Thanks. Remember, I was telling them last year when we set One. these off, uh, and remember, it, it kind of didn't poop all the way. Do you remember that? Yeah. And it was just kind of stuck. I remember, I was crying. That laughing you know, that so happens hard. to everybody. <laughs> it does. It happens to everybody. Yeah, it does. All right, thank you very much, Kim. Tell the boys and said hi. Well, it's time to play the game. We call